Good morning, everyone. Morning. I know. I woke up this morning not feeling well. Like, I had to, yeah, me too. I had to take Tylenol already. What is that? I put this, I grabbed the sweatshirt and I didn't realize it was this linty. So it's a shaver. Oh. Does that work? I mean, it doesn't have to. Trudy, what? What is, what's happening now? I'm taking the lift off. I don't have time to do it in here. It's okay. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Oh. I have never in my life seen one what, of those things. What, instead of those, well, let me see it. Oh, wow. You got a lot of lint. I told you. I don't know if I cleaned it up from I was going to say, how could that much lint be on that no, sweatshirt? That, That's crazy. But instead of those sticky things. Right. Instead of the, I can't fucking see. I can't see shit. This is horrible, Judy, your road. When did they say it was going to be done? Yeah. Anyway, I woke up with like a little bit of a sore throat, but not, I don't know, it's weird. And then my head really hurts bad. So like I said, I took two Tylenol right away. So my thyroid pill probably isn't reaching me today because I didn't have time to just Get it all? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I just saw it by my pocket and it was driving me nuts. Okay. <laughs> well, Lindy, in my Lindy. pocket. Well, I left something in my pocket apparently when I washed it. Oh, god, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. Oh, I know. I just. I... And I, I feel, feel plump too. Yeah, and I almost feel like I have a slight fever. There, like there's a possibility. Did you well, the rain? No. Oh, you really? It poured last night. I had my window open. No, I didn't hear it. It poured like. Was there thunder lightning? No, it was oh. just rain. Pouring though. I didn't hear a thing. Like eight o'clock. Oh. What? Yeah. It poured. At least by my house. Not by mine. Because I let the dog out like at 7.30 and then we came porn. back in and I watched a little show. My Korean show. So I'm so confused about this goddamn Korean show. Okay. But I keep on watching it because I'm telling you I get hooked on it. But I just don't know what's happening. So then I got to call Izzy and she's got to explain it to me. Story of my life. What is that? I can't remember what it's called, but it's good. It is really good. So here's another issue that I have. Like the name, their names are like Jung Hoo Lee or something like that. Or like, you know, whatever. They're like three little names combined into one name. And if you don't pay attention to the names, you get confused as to who is who. Because to me, a lot of the times, like, the guys and the girls look alike. And I can't tell the difference between the two. So it's like, oh my god. But I love it. So that's that. Ooh, that dog did not like that man. Yeah, my eyes are, like, watery. Nose is stuffy, throat is scratchy, head is hurty, body is achy. That man swimming next to me also explained to his buddy who was next to him, who was next to you, mm -hmm. that he woke up with a sore throat. Yeah, so him. he wasn't going to be exercising that hard. And I'm sitting there thinking, well... I heard him. And I think they both took off work. They were all splashing yesterday. Holy schmoly. Judy and I, my hair was completely wet. It was like, jeez. 
by the time I got out of the pool. And usually, yeah. like, I'll put it up in a high bun so, like, it doesn't get wet at all. My hair was sopping and in I the back. I have short hair. My, the back of my head was soaked. Because they were splashing. It was right annoying as faces. fuck. It was annoying. And I had them on either side, so I didn't know which way to look at. Right. I only had that one guy who was sick on my side. <sighs> oh my god I know you didn't my package was stolen so here's Someone another stole your rice no I got the rice okay oh, update geez. update on the packages so I had a Walmart order with clothes and I had a rice order from Amazon, which they refused to deliver my rice. I don't know why. This was the other day. Not yesterday, but the day before. So, I got my rice yesterday, no problem. It was with all the other packages. And it was, I thought maybe it was because they didn't package the bag of rice in an Amazon thing. Oh, <laughs> I scared her again. You know what I mean? Like I didn't, like they didn't put it in an Amazon bag. So I could understand they just don't want to leave like a bag of rice outside someone's door. Like, I don't know. Anyway, nope. It was in an Amazon bag and it was with everyone else's. So I don't know why my rice was not delivered the day before. Maybe they just wanted to see who lived there or something. I don't know. Like, why would they call me? Why would they? It's ridiculous. I'm ranting again. Anyway, so I get home. What time did I get home yesterday? 2.30 maybe? And I look to see where my Walmart package is for my clothes. And it said that my package was delivered at 10.27 a.m. So I'm sitting there thinking, okay, it must be outside my door. Not my door door, but like the main door. And, but sometimes people will like bring packages in if they see them out or whatever. And we have cameras everywhere. So, well, no package when I came home. So I hopped online and I did the chat with a live person. I, like first you had to do the automated chat, then you had to do the live chat. So I got this guy and he's like, Sometimes what can happen is FedEx will say it's delivered, but then they have to transfer it over to USPS and then the post office will deliver it to you. And I'm like, okay, but it said that it was delivered at 1027. So you're telling me that they accidentally put that it was delivered to my home and left at the front door at 1027. But that means that it delivered to USPS. I knew it was a bunch of bullshit and he was trying to like throw me off. So I went on the website for FedEx and it showed a picture of where they left my package. My package was not left in front of my door or in my building. It was in a different building. So I'm not gonna physically go and search for my package. I'm not going to go knocking on neighbors' doors and be like, you got my Walmart clothes? So I'm like, fuck it. So I went back online to walmart.com, spoke with the automated thing. Then I got another live person and I said, I saw the picture, said it was delivered at 1027. That's not my door. I'm not, I'm not going to go in a three mile radius to look for my package. That's what it said on the website. Check with your neighbors in a three mile radius. Are you fucking kidding me? So they gave me, they gave me a refund. Okay, but you don't have your clothes. Or you do have your clothes. I don't have, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, you do. You have your clothes. I don't know what's going on. I'm upset about it. And then maybe, so here's the clincher. Here's my karma. My karma is that maybe the pants that I ordered maybe came in the wrong size that I ordered. Maybe. So 
So maybe I ordered, let's say it a large and maybe I got a small, maybe. So that's my karma. So I got a refund for that. I reordered in the right size and hopefully it arrives. My nails are so dark. You guys, I picked out uh, like a raspberry rose, a dark raspberry rose. I got, I got a burgundy, which I'm fine with. It's like burgundy. Well, or it's like red. Well, it's like burgundy. a it's like blood red. Mine looks like a berry red. And that's that's kind of what I wanted. I wanted like but I wanted it more pink and less red. But still dark at the same time. Well, things just did not work out. It's okay. And I did forget to punch out yesterday, so I had to do a change request. Well, yeah, it happens. It happens. Ugh. I brought our papers. I brought this. I brought our local paper. And then I brought this paper. So we can read that today. Uh, I didn't even grab my paper. Do you have sausages today or chicken? Not, nothing. Oh my God. Judy forgot made, the meat. No, because I made the brats on Monday and I made meatloaf last night. So this is the one. This is the one. That so pretty color. It is pretty color. I love it. I love it. And it goes perfectly oh. with that. How, like, that worked. For me in my favor. This, a size too big, but whatever. I'm just gonna roll with it. <sighs> I haven't had. Why well, yeah, I do have something coming? <gasps> Where did you order from, Judy? Tord. Oh, tops. <clears throat> tops. <clears throat> Bottoms. Two, three, three tops. A top. A top, mm -hmm. a top, a top, a top. It's so expensive there. They're on sale. Like a good sale? Just buy two, get one free. Oh, uh, whatever. Then one was on clearance. Oh, that's good. So, so did you get the clearance one for free? No. Oh, okay. That's no. good. So I don't want to order it. <clears throat> right. Sometimes they swindle you and do that, though. So you have to figure, I've always figured out, it's like, okay, so it's this price, divide by three, so it's really not that bad. Right, and then you figure, like, how much each top would have been. Right. For the total price. Well, I, just need, I do that I I've never been on a cruise before, so I didn't know. Oh, my God. That's coming up. Yeah. Are you go. nervous? No. You're going to fall off that <laughs> boat. Who's going to throw you a buoy? No, I'm not throwing falling off the boat. Oh my god. Judy's going on an Alaskan cruise. What do you think you're going to see, Judy? A whale? It is, actually. Oh my god. I'm watching. I know, but then now they're attacking. What if that shark's come and attack the cruise gonna, ship? It's not going to. Okay. <clears throat> but anyway, I don't know what they... Go see a little penguin? Like when you go out for dinner, what you're supposed to... How many times are you docking? Four. Oh. Four? See, for me, that would be it. I don't want to see the water. I don't want to get sick. Four, maybe five, actually. Well, there was a story recently about an Alaskan cruise. You saw it. I know you did. <laughs> Looking at your face, I know you saw it. Where they had to turn around and go back. Cause the Why water would you want to send this bad juju to me? Because <laughs> the water got a little rough. Um, uh, Judy went to see, 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 to see what she could see, see, see. And all that she anyway. could see, 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 was the bottom of the Atlantic, see, see, see. <laughs> 
Well, first of all. Because she went over. First of all, you're on the wrong side. Oh. <laughs> I'm not oh going to be God. on the Atlantic side oh. of the ocean. Well, it's not that. Anyway, that's why the ones like it's. So you're flying into, into Washington? We're flying or, into Seattle. Into Seattle. That'll be fun. Then we leave for Seattle. I've always wanted to go to Seattle. Um. Maybe you'll be able to stop at the um, flagship Starbucks in Seattle. It's like a popular place to go. I don't know. Well, just watch out. Keep an eye out. Always watch your back. Like, I don't do that at, at, every day. I know. I think I got sick because all those kids were literally in my face yesterday. Okay, guys, we got to go. We got to lift the weights. What does? We have to lift and squeeze. Oh, God, this person is backing up into the stall. And he is going to hit that vehicle. Holy hell. Oh, no, he's got oh, it. Oh, he's fine. Okay. He's got it. You're so dramatic this morning. Oh, it's our friend. Oh. <laughs> You're it's so our friend. so dramatic. Well, my lord. My eyes. My nose. My life. You what know, is he driving? Really a lot Opac. of different SUVs around. I like his car. That's an Outback. It's a little bit bigger. That's what I want. Any sugar daddies out there? Get me an Outback. And not a steak. Are those even open anywhere? Outback Steakhouse? I don't know, but their blooming Onion was great. And then they had an awesome peach drink. That was so good. That's what I would get every single time I went. I would I get the blooming onion. There actually. I would get the blooming onion know. with the sauce, and then the peach. They, they had like a in-house peach alcoholic drink, and it was so good. It was like spot on. I must have because I've had the blooming onion. Mm. Either that, or we just went there for like a happy hour and had just appetizers and and drinks and drinks. It was an okay place to go. I mean, mm. it was kind of like a TGI Friday type whatever. It was okay. They're all kind of like that. Yeah. That and Chili's. Chili's. I don't think I've ever been to Chili's. <coughs> it's kind of like the same. I've never been to Chili's before. I and I don't like TGI Fridays either. I'm freezing. So I, like it. I am too. I only have a t-shirt on. I gotta take mine off. I mean, I gotta take Chili's. my sweatshirt off. Baby back ribs. Barbecue sauce. Uh uh. No? no barbecue. Oh. No barbecue. Why? Is it too spicy? No, I just. Judy doesn't like it spicy. I like some. I don't. I mean, I, I like a Is little that your bit. Stomach? Probably. I like oh a little bit, God. but not. I don't like where it's like burning your mouth and it. No, there's, to me, there's a I difference like the between a, between a good spice, like hot spice, like that's actually flavorful mm -hmm. and has a little bit of bite, as opposed to where it's just flipping hot. Yeah, and you can't even you digest can't even, it or anything, and your lips are on fire forever that's because stupid. That I do not like. Who does that? I don't know. I have to drop my shit off today. I want to be in my house right now. Yeah. In my jammies with a hot cup of coffee with a little bit of sugar-free cream with my dog on my lap watching my Korean show. Well. That's where I want to be right now. I, oh, oh. I'm excited for my dog to get groomed on Friday. He needs it. He's a fluffy fluff ball. What's the temperature supposed to be Friday? 70s. Is that good? Maybe we can sit outside then. 
I mean, in the morning it won't be. It'll be chilly. But it depends. But we can get a sweater. If it's sunny, if it should it's be fine. If it's sunny, it won't be bad. Right. Okay, guys. We're going to go. I hope everyone has a great Wednesday. Happy hump day. Stay safe. And yeah, we'll see you guys later. Enjoy. Bye. Enjoy. Oh, shit. Sorry.